See those bare trees? Bright sun? In a couple of days, it's going to be gray and ugly and sub-zero. If you don't have your trickle charger on your scooter yet, it's a good idea to get it on there quickly, like today. If you have a genuine buddy, you've actually looked at the body of this scooter. It's certainly not a Stella. It's all plastic. It's got seams galore with screws. I didn't really want to do an exploratory surgery just to find the battery. So after quite a bit of searching, um, I actually found out where the battery was. So I thought I'd do a quick video just to show you where it is. In case you've got your trickle charger in hand and know where to go with it. it the battery is actually located on the floor of your scooter. Remove the floor mat. Get this brown little or black little box. Remove these two screws. And there it is. This is your battery tendril that you'll want to connect and leave connected to your battery. Um, so that when you turn the, the scooter off and you want to hook up to your trickle charger, you'll just connect to this, make this connection right here to the charger, and you don't have to go in and manipulate on the battery every time you're going to charge it. So what I'm going to do is show you where we're going to put this on the buddy. Looks like we can run it down through this area right here and then zip tie it underneath and kind of leave that in a semi-permanent position so let's feed this in first about connecting the the positive and this is your little 5 amp fuse for the charger okay, okay the, the pigtail is connected to the battery um, I had run the the connection end of the pigtail down underneath the scooter and had planned to zip tie it somewhere underneath here but in an effort to keep it out of the road grime, dirt, and not having to get dirty down there when you connect it every time you pull into your garage and want to connect it, um, it works to take this panel off, just then re remove all the screws, and it just pops out, and then run the connection end of the pigtail right up through this area right here. Put your panel back on, put your screws back in, and you can see it's really handy for easy connection to your recharger, your trickle charger. Screw your battery cover back down on. Put your mat back on. It actually has nice little holes so it'll it'll stay put. Press those little rubber pegs back down in your holes.
the Deltran battery tender junior 12 volt that we're going to use to winter over for the scooter. We just remove this little cap and then plug this in. Connect the two and you're ready to go.